Welcome to another video from New York City. You can tell I'm excited. We got a sunrise at the Brooklyn Bridge and today it's very likely going to be one of the hottest days in NYC even though it's already the end of September. And uh, as of right now, I'm waiting for a buddy who is gonna help me out to film today. Super excited for that. So we're gonna get a few shots, gonna film a few topic videos. And then for today, it's gonna be a hot day. We're gonna hit the gym, we're gonna get a tan, we're gonna meet some people. I'm I'm pumped. Maybe it's the morning coffee that is speaking out of me, but it is definitely the morning energy. So with that, let's get into it. Too much excitement now. Hello. One thing I'm not gonna lie about, and I'm really not happy with that, so often I'm just late on time. Doesn't, didn't change in New York right now. Heading to a movie theater to watch a very special movie. Hey. Feel good, feel very good. Queens is not as close as you think. <laughs> it actually is very close, I'm surprised. I hope it didn't start again. I, I think it did. Alrighty, coming out, out of the movie theater. Yay! Happy music. Okay, and actually this movie theater, it's really cool. Like they, the guys just told me that it's a really old place. You said like over a hundred years? So you definitely see some of that. Just everything here, the entrance, the ceilings. And the coolest place is supposed to be over there, so let's check it out. So we're gonna get a shot of you? Yeah, let's go. Um, I met this one guy, he has been dancing on the street. I don't know, I just want I, I was just like, hey, hey, just jump in, jump in. You got a story of me? You got a clip? Still telling. Uh, my moves are horrible, but um, I'll I'll watch him do it. There's a bodybuilder playing basketball. Man, Manhattan at its best. Great day. It's coming from the movie theater, and I really wanted to watch this movie. And for a documentary, great storyline, and uh, obviously also the content and the impact. Um, yeah, makes me think if I want to go a little bit even more plant-based, I have been going uh, definitely into that direction for the past few months and years. So I'm thinking about doing like a vegan month. I said that in a review video that I just filmed for the second channel. And yeah, on my way back uh, into the East Village right now, I'm going to go up to the hotel, do some editing, do some boring work basically. Um, I'm You're just stuck in that so, as of right now, a few good hours of editing later, it's sunset. I'm standing outside the window, waiting for you. You were always taking time, baby, playing with you. Coming out of the subway, we are at Union Square Park, and what can I say, this is the last day right now. I mean, still gonna be here tomorrow all day long, but whenever something has an expiration date, and you know it's gonna be soon over, let's say a chapter, 
you start to see everything differently. I'm just like, I'm feeling like the first day in New York now, or maybe like the first week, just excited about everything. Everything that I see, everything that I smell, everything. Maybe it's just the coffee. All right, first thing today, hitting a workout with Ethan, then we're meeting up with Brett, and uh, it's gonna be fun. Let's get some gains. What's that about? You took it already? I don't know, does it look like I did? No, nope, not yet. No, you <laughs> look normal like always. <laughs> Good ideas. Uh, I think it's like some herbs. So, I am again at the Switch Gym. Probably most likely last time. We What's got up? Ethan here. We're back. Man, like so far this good times. This guy, I'm already like I already had a coffee before I got here. Yeah. Now you're hooking me up with pre-workout. We got the pre-workout. We have It's going to get a little crazy. Only... Marketing. I like that. <laughs> All right, we got Shane over here. What up? What are we going to do like full upper body? I don't know. Well, like, what do you guys think? I know the pre-workout is definitely working. <laughs> I, came, I came like to do legs and you're like, we're doing uh, chest with upper body. I'm like, okay, uh, okay. No, I'm like no, 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 no legs for me. We're skipping leg day. What, what do you think? What's your story? You're from South Africa? Yeah, I'm originally? from Cape Town, South Africa, which is pretty cool. Cool. Um, heading back next week. Awesome, man. Anyone I... who hasn't been, highly recommend it. Cape Town, South I have Africa. not been. I have not you been. You should go. I will. Next do a trip. vlog there. Get nice you there. Let's, Let's get into it. It is getting dark right now in New York City and my next stop we're gonna be meeting up with Brett Conti, a fellow YouTuber, one of the best filmmakers probably in New York City. Excited, gonna hang out, gonna chat a little and uh, yeah. In the past few days I've been actually doing quite a little bit of nightlife in New York City which I'm like, no, you know, you know, I'm not the biggest guy for but haven't captured anything on camera yet so that might be one of the things that we need to get busy with tonight. Yeah, should be around the corner somewhere. We're just still living now with his girlfriend, and then I moved in here. Um, I've been here for a couple months now, it's been amazing. I love it. Ireland? Ireland, exactly. How's living in New York? It's amazing. It just feels like one giant college campus. Like right now, I'm gonna take Danny to a couple of my favorite spots. Let's do it. Hopefully, you like them. I uh, sure will, yeah. Perfect. Brett, how do you feel when people watch your videos when you are there? I hate it. I hate it too. Like kicking off the nightlife vlog tonight. Oh yes. Brett, Brett, GG. It's the Lower East Side right here. And I nev I, I've never seen it that busy. I've been here a few times, but it's crazy busy. All right. Red and I are we're balls deep in here. <laughs> we're, we're balls deep in the lower east side. It's about like 1 a.m. Yeah. Dancing on the dance floor. This guy went topless break dancing in the bar. Don't tell them. It Don't wasn't in the them. vlog, but it did happen. Yeah, you 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 dared me, man. You dared me with your idea. What are you doing, girl? Are you embarrassing me right now in my vlog? In my own vlog? That's good, huh? What about Mets games? I hear they have good food. I've really? never been to a new baseball, baseball game. Oh my god! I have never been. Same. Do you have like a favorite memory from being a kid? You can a lot of stray dogs. They, they come up uh, sometimes in the streets. What? And they, they just stray dogs. Where, where are you from? Pakistan. Wow. Danny, what's your favorite childhood story? Childhood story? Do you really want to hear it? Yeah. Uh, we're gonna be hanging out with a brat. Okay, and so we are at 373 
gonna see what Brett is up to here. Come in! I will! I hope you're hungry. For you. Oh, what? What's up, Danny? What's up, man? How you doing? I'm like, you know, self identity. I'm the guy who goes to know. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Yeah, yeah, I was with your friends, like. No, it was fun. It was fun. Right, Brett Conti's office here. Very nice, man. Thanks. It's it's Thank always you. always interesting, you know. You see it in a video, and then you come in here. We got Chris over there. What's up? So you did trapeze today? Yeah, we flew yep. along on some ropes and over the Hudson River on top of a rooftop in New York. So if you come to New York, I highly recommend doing this trapeze because yeah, it was so yeah, worth yeah. it. Video will be up soon, I suppose. Yeah, it should be up in like two days. Yeah. <laughs> I was about to say preview, but... Look at, yeah, so but you'll, you'll just like see Brad... I swung onto some girl's arms, and then she made me fly. <laughs> <laughs> <That's crazy. laughs> For hours, what would you recommend to do? There's just one thing. Like, I don't know if you're into that, but... We're right now down here by the pier, so stop by at Brett's office. On the one side, really cool space to create some creative work, and he, together with Chris, they are cooking up some crazy videos. I'm really excited to see that, but even more, I just really wanted to hear a little bit more of uh, Brett's story. I just one idea that, like, whatever you do, even if it's something very different whenever you have like something that you work on work on be it a creative endeavor be it something that is not as common and you don't know how you will make it work but also if you just want to feel free and build a certain freedom of something you have to accept uncertainty and uh, Brett actually he mentioned he brought that up yesterday and I absolutely see it the same way as well if you want to do something that does not promise you that everything is gonna go well on the one side it's scary but on the other side it also gives you freedom and just like to be to be better with uncertainty to not be sure what's gonna happening that is gonna feel that's gonna make you excited and especially if you have like if you follow this wish of freedom and an adventurous life that's something you genuinely want to do and uh, I feel like very often if I talk about building freedom and living a life on your own terms a lot of people um, confuse it with the fact of like oh you just be you know you're just free you don't have to do anything you don't have responsibilities but actually it is more of the opposite of that you accept like just hey there is a certain uncertainty and it's your responsibility to make it work so yeah really had a great talk with Brad and also me being right now in New York City this is sort of like me following this certain uncertainty on the journey of building the freedom that I want to have so with that last full day in New York City. Well, we'll see what else I'm gonna be up to this evening, but for now, one month in New York City is coming to an end. It has been a crazy ride, and with that, we're gonna see each other at the other part of the world. Smash the thumbs up button if you haven't yet, and I'm checking out. Until next time.